Hello everyone, this is Ryan the Gaming Lawyer. I just wanted to make a quick announcement before this video begins to let everybody know that at this point I have joined the YouTube Partnership Program. Uh, the main reason for doing so is that it allows you to upload videos for a later scheduled release dates and I tend to record videos in bulk and have a backlog of episodes to be released and it just makes it a little easier and streamlined for me and will create more of a uh, consistent release schedule for you, the audience. So the plan right now is to have uh, videos releasing every day at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So, uh, and you will also start seeing ads popping up on the video as well. However, uh, at the point of this recording, the channel is relatively small. So it's not about uh, the money. It's just, uh, just want to get it all set up so I don't have to go back later and change everything. But uh, so that's the big news. Every day, 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, new videos released on the dot by an amazing automated process. So thank you all for your time. And uh, without further ado, here is the official episode. Thank you. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of A Lawyer Plays Alien Isolation After Hours. I do actually have some good news about my After Hours specials. Uh, I was talking with my wife the other day, and she says that she hasn't been able to hear me and encouraged me to not have to be so quiet as, as I have been on occasion. So, hey everyone, you know, a little glimpse inside my life and good news. But I do like the, uh, the After Hours designation, though. It, I just find it entertaining that, like, I'm taking something that would be a limitation and trying to tout it as like a feature, like a special, like, hey, guess what? Special episode, guys. I have to be, <laughs> I've got to be more quiet. That's just my sense of humor. Um, gosh, I saved in a weird place here. Uh, we are currently looking to escape to the Torrens, and we're trying to find a way to let them dock. And that's really all we know. It's something to do in this room. And I think I saw a bad guy walking in this room right before I saved. So without further ado, I will jump in and see what happens. Can't get in there. Is it smoky in here? Okay, I think it's smoky. Restore power. All right, so nothing, nothing significant has developed. I'm feeling, I'm feeling timid again. Now see that guy. Someone must know what's looks like trouble. Can I sneak by him over here? I don't want to fire the first shot. Because, yep, I hear flappy feet. Can I sneak in here before? Is he going to hear me? Is this I mean, I know it makes noise, but is it going to make real noise? So I'm going to guess this is not part of his regular... Shit! I can't remember the last time I slept. Let's hope he was not a bad guy. Or I hope he was a bad guy. Shit! first. I broke my own rule. Okay, is there some place... 
he just went down there. So you know what? I'm going to take that opportunity to come around here and see if there's anything. This seems to be a completely useless place to go. instances where it's worth using a noisemaker. And just play a little matchmaker. Too much noise. No. Oh, shit. Don't come over here to hide. did it. Alright, flappers. Go get the, that guy over there made that noise. Fuck out. Flappers. Flappers. Shit. Flappers looks... No. Don't look for me, dude. Get the other guy. Where'd he go? Shit. Okay, this is this is tense. This is kinda tense. Where did that other guy go? Afford to use that fuel. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Go get him, Flappers. Okay, we're gonna play a little hide in the sight line until he. Hopefully goes up an event. He's just he's just there, isn't he? He is, he's just there. He's just like Is he getting smarter? game here, my friend. Where's he going? I can, I'm looking at the shadow on the fucking front. Okay. <laughs> it's the second time he's, he's done that maneuver where I'm like, oh, he knocked me down. Did he knock me down and then run off? Nope. It's right there. Okay. Hey, pal. Whoa, whoa. Don't make this hard. Whoa, whoa. What's your problem? Whoa, whoa. I shoot you. Go ahead. Ha ha. Ha ha. Didn't even have to use the noisemaker that time. But is, once he's down, does he just stay down? Gotta be a better way of doing this. This is terrible. He comes and then he just never leaves. I'm starting to think maybe the trick here is just not to alert the the human in the first place. Because yeah, once he's here, he just wanders around till. 
eventually stumbles into you. this quick 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 so stressed out right now. What's that? Click bonding agent. Don't come in here. Good for a repair job. 1851. Okay. I'm not even gonna bother. This is so clear. You guys took too long down there. Not messing around. I'm writing that code down. Okay. So something's got to happen up here, right? I had to power down this facility and take the last transit. There is the sanctuary wide open. Our friend, he all just all it'll take is one creature to get in, and all the supplies and weapons we've taken will come to jack shit. Me and mine are gonna sit this out till the rescue comes. I'm sorry. Rescue, huh? I'm sorry, Shit. but when you started chasing after a ship that'll never come, you broke with the plan. Sinclair out. Alright, I was only half listening to that. But I'm pretty sure he's he's in this second little section with me right now. It seems like this alien... Oh, thank God. I was say, it seems like he spends a lot of time, like he'll just stop. Wait, like quietly. Does he have a... Oh, thank God, he's got some flamethrower fuel. Oh, and I've got that code to get in here. Oops. Shit. 1851. Oh, I got nervous. I got nervous and pushed the wrong buttons. Okay. Is that a safe station? Yeah, you know what? Yes. I was gonna say, maybe I should figure out what I need to do here first, but I don't want to have to go through all that again to get in here, because that's... that was not an easy thing. power to... Okay, so now I can go back. That looks like right by... Shit. I hear him walking out there. This is terrible. Open up! Shit! 
Okay. I don't know if I'm just not up for this tonight, but this is... I'm feeling like absolutely petrified. Okay, hit this. Just gonna go. I'm just gonna walk out. feel more bold if I had more flamethrower fuel. Okay, so locker, locker, going straight down, straight down. Yep. I think part of the problem might be it is actually kind of late. I just, I just honestly just felt like playing. And at this point, because you can't really backtrack if I want to play, I got, you know, gonna record. So, it's one of those situations where I feel like, uh, now that I'm in, I'm like, oh my god, I just can't handle this right now. <laughs> I mean, I can, I'm good. But, and maybe it just did get harder here. I mean, that that could be the case. Shit. Shit. He's pacing around out there. Dude. I'm good here when they were sealing the sanctuary. I don't know what I expected. <sighs> Maybe they changed their mind and let me in. Maybe they shoot me dead. They shut the door in my face. He's right there. I see can his... hear movements from the floor below me. <laughs> I'm pointing at the I'm screen, saying, see his mouth? Kingsley and his people have Sebastopol's food supplies and much of its weaponry. But I heard the voices of children, too. I'd wondered where the children duck. had gone. Duck. Perhaps I can keep these monsters from them. What they do. Okay, I guess I'm beyond the point of caring about those logs because I'm playing them, but I'm paying absolutely no attention to them. Where's he at? He's right there. He is coming in. He can hear the motion tracker if he's close enough, but... <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is probably... I can't gauge, but I'm feeling like this is probably the, the most painful episode to watch yet because I'm just like... Shit! I'm paralyzed. I'm just paralyzed. And I haven't saved. Okay. He's gonna walk by, not come in, not, he doesn't come in, he just walks by when I see him coming around the corner there, shit, don't, do not, there, see, no, 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 Dude, it's all I can 
should say. Is the car here yet? For Christ's sake. It's still not here. I don't have time for this. I've been up. Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going for broke. I'm going in. resources here. Got a noisemaker I didn't use yet. I need to get over there. So therefore, I will throw this as far as I can over there. that noise maker. Oops. Which did nothing. I still had to use a bunch of fuel. Flamethrower is dead. I can't even use it to light ducks. Oh, this place is getting like wobbly looking. Because of the decaying orbit. to go the other direction. I saw a burning Joe. Oh, thank goodness. At least I can use it as a torch. It's probably not even enough to get the alien away from me one time. What if... Oh, crap. You know what? I'm afraid there's going to be eggers in here. What? Is there no place to go? Was this a dead-end duck? Oh, that is not cool. That's the first rule of ducks. They're supposed to lead somewhere useful. Joe was that? Was he wearing a slicker? He is 
wearing a slicker. What an asshole. Okay. I've got four bolts. I am so low on everything right now. Okay, I'm moving. I'm going. Don't give a shit. I'm going. You blow all your walls at me all you want. Hey. Yeah, what? I don't even want to go this way. Hey. Yep, running does cause accidents. Keep going. Shit. We're at that point. Like, can't fight anything. All we can do is run. Luckily, they don't go very fast. I need to keep... I need to move fast, but I gotta keep looking for... Especially flamethrower fuel. Fuck! Shit! No fucking way. He sees me, it's it. Think about it. Alright, come here, bitch. qualifies. Backlit by flame. Unless I want to just strike some kind of epic pose and terrify the alien. And be like, oh, that guy looks kind of badass. Meet somebody else. That is... Okay, 
Passcode, please. Passcode, please. One, 1984. No time to read the niceties. That was 1984, right? I guess... Flamethrower fuel! special there. Alright. Alright. Wait, what is that blue icon? Keycard lock. Oh crap, that's right behind me. What is... And I, I think I've got a keycard somewhere. progress. Shit! That is a legitimate dead end. Oh my I just I just I did I hear a save station? Door locked. do is go in here, which appears to be the direction where Flappers is. Here it is. <sighs> All right. Well, we're going to call that an episode. Uh, thank you for bearing with me. I'm sorry if... I don't know how that episode was to watch, to be honest. Because I was literally, like, in fight or flight mode. So I don't know what I was saying or if I went 20 minutes without saying anything at all. I just don't know. This was this was a very 
stressful episode for me, and probably because I started it too late. I probably should have just gone to bed, but I felt like <laughs> I felt like playing. Anyway, uh, thank you everyone for joining me for another episode of A Lawyer Plays Alien Isolation After Hours. Until next time, take care everyone. Bye-bye.